All right, we are here at the Black Magic booth, and uh, Black Magic is continuing their tradition of coming out with lots of stuff. <laughs> and uh, we've been seeing these on the website for a little while, and they are now shipping. So uh, we've got some uh, Smart View Duos and a Smart View HD. Dan, I'm here with Dan uh, May from Black Magic. Dan, why don't you tell us a little bit about these monitors? Yeah, sure. They're just really simple monitors we wanted to create. You know, we found so many different applications, both in post production and now that we're moving into live production, where folks just need really simple, you know, effective monitors they can go ahead and throw up. So these are just great little, you know, seven inch bright reference monitors, SDI in, loop through, a couple of options that you can just go ahead and, you know, tag in there so you can make a big wall like this. And it's nothing horribly complicated, but they're just effective enough to be able to lay a bunch of them down and get set up really easy, cost effective, put them in the rack and be done with. But we also knew we wanted to make a bigger monitor so we could go ahead and have something that would be something for a director or a DP or someone that wanted to have a, a program out of a live production switcher. So we wanted to make this full 1920 by 1080 uh, monitor, which these are just about to start shipping probably in the next four or five weeks here. So we wanted to bring those out and show everyone at the uh, WFX show, you know, these guys, because they're doing, these are doing really well for us. And we look forward to seeing these kind of continue to kind of push the envelope for what Blackmagic traditionally does. Right, right. Yeah, so they look great and the price wise, uh, very, very competitive on the price. And, uh, you know, like I say, for a, for a simple H SDI monitoring solution, very, very handy. Yep. Now sliding down the rack here a little bit, we have uh, the new HyperDeck Studio and HyperDeck Shuttle as well. These are uh, these are both new products that you guys are putting out. And uh, tell us a little bit about those. Yeah, sure. These are these are little SSD recorders. So you know you basically are just buying these off the shelf SSDs. We're not making these. We've got some different ones certified for you. And what these do is they're basic uncompressed you know, record and playback solution. So basically, when you look at our booth, all the video that's playing in our booth is just a bunch of HyperDecks in the back looping video. So, you know, on one side, they're just a really simple, like, how do I playback video? How do I, how do I capture some video, take it across town and play it back? But even on the, you know, I look at this as like if you put on the back of a camera and now it's recording, you know, uncompressed clips, just normal quick time. I pull that SSD out, I put it in a dock, now I'm editing right off of there. Or I'm, I'm using this unit, the actual studio unit, like an actual deck where I'm, you know, recording, you know, if I'm recording video, it's telling me how much time I have left. It's going to now jump over to the next SSD so I can do kind of unlimited recording back and forth, some deck control capabilities, you know, obviously the little GUI there for looking at the the monitor so they're just again what we what we always try to do is say how do we make a simple solution that can apply to a lot of people you know this isn't a total replacement for every deck out there but it's got that functionality that can be deck like or you know vtr like for you so you know both really compelling units doing uncompressed video on an ssd uh, but the simplicity of the units is really where they can apply to a lot of different people out there right right and then uh, another product that uh, we saw I actually noticed on the website uh, just the other day and the first time i'm seeing them in the wild yep. is uh, the new ruggedized or heavy duty versions of the mini converters and uh, it also looks like you guys have uh, lowered the price on some of these as well yeah a couple, a couple weeks ago we decided to lower all of our mini converter prices so the rugged the heavy duty converters that we have here have fallen in suit so they're about a hundred dollars more more than our normal mini converters but what we found is we had a kind of a, a growing client base that you know that love our mini converters and we, we move a lot of them out there but folks that were taking them out into the field you know they're taking them into a war zone or into a different country or they're just the traveling a lot you know the, the regular mini converters are great you slap it on the back of the camera and everything's great or you have it in a post-production facility and life's wonderful with the the rugged converters were really about the you know I am going out and I'm beating the heck out of my gear uh, and what we wanted to do is we wanted to build an enclosure that can really protect all the the BNC cables so that you, you know nothing's going to come in here and mess with them. It's a, it's a lot thicker casing that we have in here uh, and we have this great video on our website where we got a guy with a tank and he ran over one that was running and you know they're they're meant to be just you know when you need something that's going to go out there day in and day out and is not going to end up being you know banged or beaten to the point of not working for you because that's the worst thing in the field where you're like you yeah. know I, I can't call up and be like hey something's gone wrong. Right. You, these are the units for you. Yeah. Awesome. And of course, you've got a huge selection of them. I mean, we all know that no one loved the mini converters and um, complete selection of conversion formatting on, uh, on the available there. So check out the website. You can take a look at these. You can take a look at the new uh, smart views and the hyperdex at blackmagicdesign.com. Blackmagic dash design. That's right. I always yeah. forget that dash. That's a trick. Yeah. So <laughs> blackmagic dash design.com. Uh, check it out. Thanks very much. You got it.